All right, so I'm going to show you guys how to sort the data within the uh, Intro America database CSV file. So first, you want to start by opening the code book. And you're going to want to use the control F function, which will bring up a search box. At this point, you can type in you could type in your port location. So for this example, I'll use Cuba. And you're gonna get your results for your port and you're gonna scroll down and you'll find a code. You wanna copy this code because this is what you'll use when you're trying to sort your data within the CSV file. So now open the CSV file and I start with, I started with the, uh, the code place one Terra. And this is going to give me the first place of slave purchase. So here in column G, I'm going to scroll down. I'm going to click on one of any of the numbers. It doesn't matter which one. Uh, I'm going to right click on it. And I'm going to, I'm going to search for right click and I'm going to use this uh, sort feature and sort the information smallest to largest. Once I have that done, now I can scroll down and find my port with the code that I originally had. Okay, so I found my ports and I'm gonna come over to the row headings and I'm gonna click and drag and select my the ports that I've found. Now I'm going to right click and copy these ports. At the bottom of the screen, you'll see a little plus mark. This will allow you to open up another sheet. So go ahead and click that plus mark to open up a new sheet. Right click and you're gonna to wanna to paste values. And there you go. So now you have the data with the port code place Terra, which is the first place of place of slave purchase. You can do this again for the other codes. For example, if you want to do the first intended port of disembarkment, column J, you'll come back to the intra-American database. And you'll clear, locate column J. Scroll up to the top, right click, sort, smallest to largest. And again, do the same, which is just finding your port. So it looks like this port has a little bit more data values for the port, the first intended port of disembarkation. But again, I'm gonna click and drag and select all the values that contain my port. Okay, now right click, copy a new spreadsheet, paste with values. All right, and now I have all the ports of disembarkation. And then now you can just basically do the same thing for any of the other codes listed in the, the document.